Hey guys, welcome back to another video. We're going to be checking out the leaderboards in AQ3D. So the first leaderboard is right here. Is it right here? Yeah, it is. 2022 gifting leaderboard. Let's see who is on the very top. Now you get the points by having people fight your gift Thulu from the gifting runes. And wow wowzers 19,000 19,000 so ill is on the very top he's ahead by 10,000 points we then have lord quest who's in second and axel axel in third there are a lot of people in here we've got account i'm alistor skyweaver the shy i know several of these people's names save i don't know everybody iron lady toronto class there's a lot of people in here alcard so yeah there are a lot of people now this goes all the way down to 100 so you can see how many people participated it drops off vastly after a certain portion and hail i know him so this this is the number of people if you're on the list you'll be able to see your name this is also i'm kind of saving this as a archive for people that were on the list in 2022 i think i did the same thing in 2021 as well so this is really cool seeing who's on here i can't believe ill is wow right up there i haven't contributed anything because when i was buying the stuff i was buying it through this if i if i bought i didn't buy any of these but if i had bought these it would have been this one not this one that i had bought because it was more expensive but if you guys still want to get on the leaderboard you still have a chance to do that because the leaderboard is going to be leaving at the end of february if you've been wanting to host your own events and you have the dragon crystals for it you can also purchase some of these bush faction gold cards which you can then use because you'll be able to spawn a bush which will then spawn a bunch of these bushes right here you've got some travel forms and pets and stuff that people can get from the bush so it's a nice thing you know to have a nice extra thing to have for that that's the first leaderboard the next one is in celadon forest and we get to go and talk to the right guy. I forget exactly where he is, but he's over this direction somewhere. I don't remember if he was that direction or this. Oh, there he is, right there. Paladin Everett, I think that's how you say it. So in here, there is another leaderboard, the Celadin Monster Hunter leaderboard. And you can see in here, so I am at rank 7,000. Oh my goodness, 7,255. I have only killed 355 since this leaderboard came out. So this is the number one person currently, Phantom King Old Chain. Now this leaderboard, as far as I know, is permanent. It stays here. This is how many points he has. That is a massive number. Texbur is right there. He's got a very large number as well. And then you've got these all these other guys here a lot of them here they have super super high numbers there's guardian sir Fainal, right there or Fanal, Fainal, i think is how you say it a lot of other people ninefold solo player it drops off pretty quickly going from the hundred thousands and then you know dropping down to these lower ones here regretta is there did Jin raven or Jin raven oh loki monster that's cool so yeah, there's a lot of people on here. Rocks. It drops off uh, rather quickly down to the 10,000s down here. And it does collect 100. So in order to get onto the leaderboard, you would need to kill a minimum of 6,860. That's the minimum right now as of the filming of the video. The next location is in... Um, is it in here? No. Quest not started. What do you mean quest not started? I beat the darn quest. In the special locations in Moistverse, we have another leaderboard as well. Now, I don't 
know how to access the leaderboard. I don't remember if it was him. No. Maybe it's not in here. Maybe this is not the place to interact. Explore world? Is it G Fuel? Does he have the... Oh, wait. No, that's just the Moist World Tour rocket ride and the other challenges. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I have been everywhere and I cannot figure out. It says on the wiki that you can access the critical speed run from the giant guy right here. But there is no option. It also says you can talk to the guy at the beginning. And there's also no option there. You have those locations there. So it's possible they just removed it from the game. Because I'm not seeing the speed run anywhere here, which is not... It, it's supposed to be in the game and all of these guys here don't have any dialogue minus the regular dialogue they don't have any access to anything I'm also not seeing the normal guy and then it also says it's available with Matt but when you talk to Matt there is no option you have this as an option this as an option and then that so I guess they removed the speedrun, or there's a way to access it that I don't know about. It's possible because there were cheaters in it, speedrun cheaters, so maybe that's why they removed it, but anyways, so there's no access to that. There are actually more leaderboards in AQ3D, but they are legacy leaderboards no longer in the game. The first one is the AFK Game 1. This was during the 20th anniversary event in the AFK The Game area. They had the top 200 leaderboard for the people that were the AFK the most in that area. And so it's not in any particular order as far as I know. This is just a random order of people that had made it onto the top 200 so you might recognize some people's names in here i certainly <laughs> golden turd <laughs> that is not me i am actually on the leaderboard right right here there i am right there so a lot of people on here that i recognize because there was a lot of people here that were farming the thing it was very easy all you had to do was just not do anything just stand in the area so a lot of people were working to get onto the leaderboard and it went legacy. So everybody is now immortalized on this thing if you were AFK. They also have the Gift Thulu 2021. This is from last year. And we can see who the top 10 gifters of 2021 were. And the very first is Angel of Darkness. He was the very first to make it onto that leaderboard with account being next and then lord quest being third and lord quest is currently in second place and account is i believe in fourth i believe in this current thing so it's a fight to see who can maintain and then everybody else here made it up in the top 10 i recognized most of these people here so that's pretty cool that they have a top 10 gifters thing and of course the top 10 gifters of 2022 will also be immortalized on the website this is on the aq3d.com website i'll put a link to these leaderboards in the description for the set of the day i'm going with this one right here great set made it into the set of the day that is it for this one hope you guys enjoyed thanks for watching and keep those swords swinging mm -hmm.